All right, gonna make a little beat here using Scala, um, Drum Monkey by Unison. And um, I'm all doing this all in Studio One. So uh, check it out, just a little simple beat. You know, got my Scala pulled up here. Found me some chords that I like. Uh, pretty much this is out of their uh, Sad Endings um, preset. Let's see what we got here. Now what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna get the I'm gonna extract the chord track so everything will be everything when I get ready to do my 808, it'll be in tune or whatever to this within Studio One. So um just starting with that, let's go up to the drum monkey and see what we got here. We're gonna use um hip hop preset for this. Where is it? There we go. Alright, let's generate something and listen to what we got. Alright. Uh, I don't like that one. Let's see what we got here. Just to, you know, just to get something going. Boom. Now that I've dragged that over into it, all I do is just add in my drums that I want to use. I go to my files, to my desktop here. Bam. Let's get the kick going. I right, got the key. Let's go to the collapse. Let's see here. We'll just try this one. We'll go to the rim shot. Which will probably be in perk GA. Yeah. We're gonna go to the high hats, close high hats. Now all this is already done, so basically I don't have to do anything other than fill in the blanks. You know, man, make it easy for yourself when you're trying to do these things. It's an open hat. <clears throat> we got another perk here. Let's try to block. All right. Now we're going to set all these up to be one shots, whatnot. So we can uh, everything will play accordingly. Takes a little time, you know, it's nothing bad. Once it's all done, and you try pretty much ready to roll, I'm just giving you a simple breakdown on how easy it is to make tracks in Studio One using Scala and um, 
the Unison Syndrome Monkey, which are great plugins, contrary to what anyone has to say. Uh, they do us these videos claiming that these are not good plugins. These are excellent plugins if you know how to use them in the proper manner. So let's see what we got here. Just the piano going. This is off just a little bit. So I'm gonna move that over just a hair. Pull that down. Um, I'm gonna duplicate that. Boom. Now let's hear what we got here on the loop. the basis to how you store your tracks off using the unison midi drum wizard easy drag and drop with stems fill in you know your plug in what what type of drums you want to use um, that was just that's the scalar that is playing the chord progressions here so uh, I'll probably finish this beat up. I just wanted to show you how easy it is to get started when you're having block using Studio One, Scalar, and the Unison Drum Monkey. Thank you for checking me out. This is Dre Goldston of Mind Blown Productions, signing out.